Howdy folks, it's Tom from the Gaming Channel, and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Now, those of you who have actually played the game, or particularly eagle-eyed viewers, may notice that there's a bit of a skip between this episode and the last episode. Uh, a big section at the end of Sequence 4 is missing. Um, unfortunately, that is because I angered the gods of video conversion. Uh, or, sorry, video capture, actually, and I've probably just pissed them off again. <laughs> so, unfortunately, that episode is not going to be coming. Um, for whatever reason, it failed to record, um, which I cannot explain for the life of me. The uh, Yoshi's Woolly World videos and Minecraft Story Mode have all recorded perfectly fine. Um, it's just for some reason uh, the last Assassin's Creed Syndicate episode just did not work, but that's okay. Um, I'm sure there's plenty of other YouTubers out there that have done that sequence, and um, we're just going to jump right back in here with Sequence 5 and get underway. Uh, sequence 5, The Perils of Business. Owning the railway wasn't enough. Now Starek has bought an omnibus company as well. I suppose he wants to control the neighborhood's workers and keep them under his thumb. Pearl Attaway is Starek's competitor, is she? Perhaps it's time I went into business. And Miss Fry, what are your plans? I studied the history we recovered from the Kenway Mansion's hidden room. I'm off to a certain monument. Oh yes, in the last episode, I did get to visit Edward Kenway's house, which was really cool, because he had a secret room, and secret rooms are awesome. So, <laughs> voltaic bombs. Ooh, I think we're going to go do that one. Yeah, okay. So, um, this one is breaking news. I'm assuming it's um, uh, Alexander Graham Bell because uh, the reward is Voltaic Bombs, and I don't know what those are, but I want them, so we're gonna go do this one. All right, so I'm going to collect my cash here from the safe, and then we are going to travel to Alexander Graham Bell, and I will jump back to you guys when we get there. Alrighty, and here we are, we're at Alexander Graham Bell. We're gonna do the mission breaking news as Evie, apparently, because I was forcefully switched um, from Jacob to Evie um, when leaving the train, so I'm not sure if that's intentional or if maybe I screwed up, but anyway. Oh, Jacob, Evie, it's you. Thank goodness. Experimenting, are we, Alec? Correct. And looking a bit frazzled. Nerves. It's those great oafs Starrett keeps sending round to coax me. He is offering a ridiculous amount of money. Alec, you're not thinking of jumping ship, are you? Never. I've been working in something in case they get too insistent. Uh, it's meant to stun an assailant, should they need a rise. Are you certain that it works? Uh, not as such. I've made three of them with varying degrees of acidity and whatnot. Oh, one must be the right formula. Let's find some Staric lackeys to target then, shall we? <laughs> Speaking of Staric, he is still transmitting false information. We could simply destroy his transmitters. Well, his company's too well guarded. And the bombs will help, but it would be awkward to produce bombs that potentially do not stun. Oh, wait a minute. Looks like opportunity has come knocking. <laughs> Oh dear, they never looked so angry before. Stand clear, Alec. Let us instead play a little linguistic game with them. Um, take the bombs and climb onto the roof. Uh, when I see the name of uh, a fruit, toss one near the thugs. Right then. Oh, uh, oh wait, uh, I nearly forgot. Um, slip these into your boots and you will henceforth be immune to all voltaic discharge. I think. Well, 
Wow, Jacob does not look convinced. So we're going to the roof. I'm confused. Are we going just upstairs? Are we going up to the roof? Let's find out. Is it a window I can go out? Yes, it is, which is cool. Da, 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 da. Up we go. Uh, up, 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 up. Killing or alerting the thugs will cause desynchronization. Good to know. Could you jump down and be? Come on. There we go. Works for me. You got one of them telling what's it's in here, ain't you? And you've been reading messages from the Steric Company. That is as untrue as the notion. They have made these people sound more stupid. I mean, I know they're supposed to be stupid, but for crying out loud. Your employer's promises are nothing but hot air. His operations are about to turn up. Here, shake. What you going on about air and pairs, for? Whoops. Oh, I don't know, feel right. Okay, it looks like it worked. I thought I had the right ones. Shit. Okay, well, not a surprise I screwed that up, so we're gonna do it again. When I didn't tell you what's it? The Static Telegraph Company is emitting impartial information, sir. Come again? Your employer's promises are nothing but hot air. His operations are about to turn. Come again? Shaked. What's going on about air and pairs, Hawk? Oh, I don't know. Electrocute the thugs? Wait. Oh, that's disgusting. Wait for bell signal. I did. Ooh. Go fly me. Ooh. I thought I was supposed to shock them. Is he going to have me do it again? Wait, what am I doing? Am I supposed... Wait, hey! Am I supposed to kill them? I'm confused. Listen up, Belle, or I'll thump you your ears are ringing. No, killing or alerting. Okay. Your work play delights me. And to think I worried you had the mental agility of a dollop of donkey's apples. <laughs> I think he's trying to be funny. That got everybody. <laughs> oh, he is trying to be funny, but. Go blind me! He's got me trapped. Oh, oh! Those rascals throwing stink bombs again. It happens all the time around here. Okay, I have no more bombs. Bombs can be found nearby in chests. Oh, that's nice to know. You told me that a minute ago. Okay. Get up, Evie. Come on. There we go. Open. Thank you. What are you calling it? Tell me what's it. Do you really think I would keep it here? Do you see a keep? You really think I would keep it here? Do you see a cable? A telegram you see what? without a cable is about as useful as a bell without a clapper. I'll give you a bleeding clapper. Well, bless my boots, you're as purple as a plum. A plum? I feel like I'm opening my eyes. Oh. Okay, now I'm supposed to kill them. Good okay, show, gotcha. Eric. Die. Thanks to you, Evie. Yeah. Your presence gave me courage and resolve. I never knew I had. I'm glad I could help. Now it's time to shut down Stark's empire of propaganda. <laughs> Somebody's got a crush. <laughs> All right, let's follow him. Where is he going? Da, 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 da. Okay, he's turning that way. 
Where are you going? Why are you turning around? The longer we can keep Stalic from spewing out false okay, information, man. the more we can awaken the people with the truth okay. about his operations. I agree. Right. The sooner we can get there, the quicker we can act. Would you and we're doing more drugs, which is always fun, because I really suck. By that shooting so I took it upon myself to tell her neighbors the truth about the obnoxious draft. That's good, Alec. But you can't go round to every household in London town. <clears throat> no, I'm sorry. I wasn't always welcome. It shows how false information right, going? Going is difficult to stop. Five hundred meters away. Or vermin at Smithfield. But if we can eradicate the source that continually well, feeds well, such I, I'm, I'm telling you, I suck at the driving. <laughs> I'm really, really bad at it. Get out of the road. Look out. Flushed out. That's why we're here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We will have to get in without being detected, mind. I shall stand them while you get inside. I shall destroy not one, but three parts of the transmitter. He'll be as good as dancing before a public toilet without a penny. Slow down. <laughs> dancing before a public toilet without a penny. I, that's a new one. Whoa. Okay. Am I, oh, I'm here. Cool. No, wait. Electrocute thugs. Okay, there. eliminate thugs. Okay, so I'm supposed to electrocute these two doofuses with, with uh, Oh shit, I got them both! Sweet! Uh, defend belt, where is he? Oh, there he is. I did not think that I got both of them. That was kind of cool. Oh, nobody cares. Goodbye. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet. Those two never saw it coming. All right. Okay. Telegraph's destroyed. Let's go. Do, 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 do. Oh, get out of the way, dude. Do I just walk into you when you're walking around? No. Well, maybe. I, I don't care. Get out of the way. I see. This is becoming rather perilous, to say the least. Okay, where are these guys going? Where are they coming from? Oh, they're there. Yeah, but they gotta come around here. So, guess what? Goodbye. Didn't even see it coming. Hey! Wow, she's quick. Fuck. Oh, and she's dead. <laughs> Yeah, so are the guys that are chasing you. Let's go. Okay, I don't know where you get. Are you drunk or something? Jeez. All right. Yeah, Bell, pick up the speed. Let's go. Okay, they're going to come around this way. Okay. Yeah. Oh! Oh! My deals loading, 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 loading. Oh. Thanks are once again in order for supporting what is most dear to me and to our cause freedom of speech. It's a blessing that you employ your genius for the common good, Alec. However, I suggest you vacate your workshop. Uh, no need. Not now you've given me sacks full of courage. And besides, what with my little devices, I have all the protection I need. Uh, should you find yourselves with a moment to spare, do <laughs> drop by. <laughs> uh... <laughs> <laughs>
Now see, he said he had all the protection he needed. Why do I get the feeling he's going to get attacked, beaten up, and wind up having to come live with us on the train? An intuition, I think. <laughs> but we did uh, finish our challenges, so we got an extra 125 pounds and an extra 150 experience, which is cool. So we're going to keep on going. All right. Um... That I did and wanted to do specifically for the bombs because those are awesome. Um, where else can we go? Uh, Karl Marx. I kind of want to go see what that's about. Because wasn't Karl Marx one of the one of the guys that first? Um, well, shit. I just lost my train of thought. I have no idea what the hell I was saying. Anyway, we're gonna move on. <laughs> We're gonna go and do Karl Marx video or uh, memory. God, oh jeez. In my defense, it's very late, but we're just gonna move on. Um. So yeah, we're gonna jump to that uh, memory point, and then I will get back to you guys. Seriously? I'm over. Fuck you. I'm tired of dealing with your asses. Come here, you little, little dude. Come here, give me something. Hey, you might need this. Thank you. Thank you. That's what I said. All right. Alrighty, here we are. We are doing the um. What the fuck was this mission called again? <laughs> um. It, come on. All right, Cat Mouse. There we go. Karl Marx. I don't know who that is, although I feel like I should. Hmm. Hello, Karl Marx. How are you? Let's talk to you and see what you want me to do. Listen to me. I have been ordered to keep your rallies off the streets. No, you must listen to me. The people in this city are in dire need of your assistance. Oh, you are Jacob Fry, are you not? And Miss Fry. We're at a disadvantage, sir. Karl Marx. Much like you, I am an activist of sorts. You've got the look of a man who wants something. Indeed. You've done more for London citizens lately than any endeavor has accomplished in a decade. But those citizens were already well provided for. I challenge you both to help those who really need your assistance, the working people. An interesting challenge. We accept. Shouldn't we at least talk about these things for... Sod it. We accept. I am organizing a discreet meeting with some like-minded friends to discuss trade unions. Okay, so I follow Karl Marx. Seems simple enough. <laughs> In any case, I need you to help me get to the meeting without the interference of the police. Wait, you want me to take on the cops? Kill spies with hanging barrels. Locate and kill the spies. Oh, okay. Oh, ow. Oops. Wait, how do I do? Oh, there we go. Throwing knives. Kill spies with hanging barrels. I've got two of them I've got to do. So he's moving along with me. So if I can get up here. So is there any chance this guy's underneath a hanging barrel? Is 
Is there any chance whatsoever I'm gonna get these guys? <laughs> Cause I'm betting there isn't. Yeah, I don't see the opportunity presenting itself because they are not walking underneath them. Okay, so I mean, he's going over there, but is he underneath? I don't know. Maybe. Yes! Works for me. There he is. Come on. Up, 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 up. Alright, there's a spy. I have to kill. But he's not underneath the barrel. He's not underneath barrels. Oh, maybe he's going underneath barrels. Is he going underneath barrels? I bet he is. I bet he is. I bet he is. Yes! Got his ass. Alright. Up! Up, 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 there he is, I gotta kill this guy, these guys, holy crap, I'm confused, which one am I supposed to kill? Crap, I did not mean to do that. Up! Come on, Carl. Don't leave me behind. Alright, there we go. I see ya. Oh, this is where we're going. I'm your guardian angel. You know, I had similar problems with the police in Paris. Well, Paris and Brussels. And also, perhaps Cologne. So, is this it? One guy we came and talked to? I mean, that's not exactly a... Okay, not what I meant to do. There we go. Where's Where did he go? Why did you go all the way back over there, dude? <sighs> Alright, come on. Up, oh, a daisy. Up on the roof, please. So am I supposed to kill more people? <laughs> or what am I doing here? Because it looks like I'm following a guy with a beard. You know what? I'll jump down here. Our next worthy ally awaits us in a nearby park. Onwards. Holy! I've got every cop over there on on me. Holy cow. Like, jeez. And of course, Marx is still there. Because, you know, it's not like I got cops following me. No doubt the police already have agents stationed. Hide behind the cart. Get your ass moving, please. Thank you. Locate the spy. Is the spy in the bar? Spy in the bar. Well, that was easy. I can see through walls. Create a faction fight against outside the pub to attract the spy. Well, that should be easy enough. He's gonna get someone killed. I have my guys. I got my guy. Oh, there's my guys. Hey, boys. Y'all want to kick some ass? Let's kick some ass. You guys are level five. They're level two. We're going to fuck them up. Come on. Get them. Yeah. Fuck them up. On your way. 
Yeah. Bye. Whoa, jeez, that was a crack across the back of my skull that really hurt. Okay, I'm gonna let things die down a little bit because I think everybody killed everybody. Yep, everybody killed everybody, so let's go back inside. One hour. Right you are, Mr. Mark, sir. Really? All of that for you to talk to one guy? They didn't know me in here. I could have slipped in and talked to him. For frick's sake, you could have written a note. No, I gotta start a street war here. Aye. I do appreciate your assistance in this matter. Only when workers are able to assemble freely and in strength will we be able to achieve the reforms we most assuredly deserve. Might I trouble you to stay nearby until the meeting is over? I fear we may yet meet with some mischief. <laughs> My history may be a little weird, but isn't Karl Marx not one of the guys that first uh, talked about the concept of communism? Like I said, I could be wrong. My history is probably not great, but... there. So which card is he getting in? Okay, they're getting in that one. Please tell me he's coming to this one. No, he's not. He's coming to that one. Holy shit! Ow! Frick me! Okay, so I kidnapped this guy. I do it more. Are you mad? You're making a big mistake. No noise. Get in there. Alright. So I got you, now I get in the driver's seat, I'm hoping I'm going this way. Yes I am, okay, awesome. Deliver the traitor, okay. So that was a lot easier, able to get around in front of him, get the guy, get the hell back, and that last bit was just ridiculous, I screwed up so many times. Not to mention the fact that I ran the guy off the road and killed him, but you know. There you go. Um, okay, so jump down. Can I get this guy out? No, I didn't want to do that. <laughs> I wanted to grab the guy out of there. Oh, shit it. Smack you in the face. Come on. March. Nothing. Keep walking. Excuse me. Fuck out of my way. You are going to go up here. This is like the slowest thing ever. And deliver your ass right here. Speak to Marx. Hello, Marx. Simon, my friend, what possessed you to do this thing? Has the party not taken care of you? Governor of the Milsey, any man what joins a union will be put out of work comes hmm. up. How long will the party feed my family for? I, I think that's Karl Marx. Of, I think he's a communist. Like. Heart is broken, Simon. Please go. I thank you, my friend. I hope you will continue to aid the struggle when the opportunity presents itself. Again, I'm pretty sure that's Mark Karl Marx is a communist. Like he was one of the first guys to talk about like the com the benefits of the communist party, kind of thing. I could be wrong. Again, now it's going to bug me. I'm going to have to look that up. 
Anyway, uh, this seems like a good enough place to stop for the night. So, as always, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, smack that like button. Leave us comments. Um, share the video. Um, we are, of course, on all the social media. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, uh, Twitch. We're on all of those, and the links to those are in the description below. Um, holy shit, people are shooting during my outro. What the hell? Like, oh fuck, there's a whole brawl going on over there. Anyway, <laughs> now that uh, my guys have kicked some ass, alright, uh, we'll see you guys later.